With respiratory disease on the rise, it is more important than ever to practice healthy habits. I spoke to Public Health Director Tammy Riley about ways you can keep you and your family healthy this cold and flu season. It is respiratory season and anecdotally, you know, we hear the stories um, of the spread from COVID to RSV to flu. Uh, so we want to ensure that we stay as healthy as possible, remain at work, remain at school. So of course, uh, vaccination uh, for most respiratory illnesses is the um, Public Health 101 recommendation. Uh, but in addition to vaccine and protecting your immunity, we ask that individuals you know, stay home if you're sick, um, wash your hands frequently, cover coughs and sneezes, and um, again, you know, stay away from high risk um, individuals like the elderly um, and other immunocompromised populations if you do have symptoms or have been exposed. Make your ride one of a kind and see the experts at JM Custom Auto and Off Road. It's your customization candy store. Visit jmcustomauto.com and select your make and model. It's that easy. Window tinting, remote starts, leather interiors, sound systems, front and rear bumpers, spray in bed liners, bed covers, wheels and tires, lift kits, step rails, even underglow light kits, and so much more. If you can dream it, we can do it at JM Custom. Practicing these habits can help reduce the spread of respiratory viruses by over 20%. Yeah, like for your kiddos, when you're sending them to school, you know, make sure that they uh, are washing their hands and that you go over that with them. And they sing the ABCs uh, while they wash their hands. Clean those backpacks, uh, cell phones, uh, keep those um, germ-free, and uh, you know, also have those talks around um, with family about covering coughs and sneezes and you know see your primary care provider sometimes it's very difficult to to really be able to discern from cold, cold to covid um, to rsv to flu so uh, you know seek testing if um, your symptoms are more than mild for more information go to pike county health department on facebook reporting for mountaintop news i'm brianna robinson